Next, please. Welcome to Foster Bank. How can I help you today? Oh my god. You're robbing us? Rob? We're being robbed? I distinctly wrote keep quiet and no one will be harmed. The consequence of what is now about to take place rests solely on your shoulders. You're blaming me. You're robbing the bank, but you're blaming me. Well, if you had just followed the simple two-lined instructions, line one, keep your mouth shut. Line two... Okay, there's like an entire paragraph here. Well, I wanted it to be very specific, so... Seriously, who writes a note like this? It's as long as a dissertation. Enough! You're making me do this! <laughs> It's just, this morning, my lover, Henry. He dumped me! Oh. Henry? <laughs> That's my husband's He said name. it was me, not him. Oh. And me! No. Oh, he's right, I'm useless. I'm never gonna be anything but useless! Oh, for heaven's sake, try being 80. I can barely remember getting here, let alone why I'm here. Yeah, we'll try getting a decent job. Hell, any job for that matter. Once you've done time in the slammer. Who the hell are you? Everybody on the ground! <laughs> oh, you've got to be kidding me. Yeah, everyone down on the floor. Make any sudden moves and you'll get what's coming to you. <laughs> what is this? What, what, what is going on? This is a robbery! Yeah! This is a robbery! <laughs> oh my god. What are you doing? Are you kidding? I wouldn't miss this for anything. I've always wanted to rob a bank. I'll be the Bonnie to your Clyde. Can I call you Clyde? Whatever. In case you hadn't noticed, I am trying to rob this bank. <laughs> well, you're not doing a very good job of it, are you, pal? He's not doing too bad. I see he's locked the doors. No, I locked the doors. You locked the doors? How very dare you, sir. I'll have you know that I am perfectly capable of robbing this bank. Really? Yes. I just wondered did you plan a big heist? Big heist? You know, like a normal bank robber? I planned this months ago. This bank, this time of day, Sleeping Beauty over here, shift. And hey, you should really get some better security. I mean, come on. That all does suck. But hey, I did all this work. I'm not letting you rob the bank. I'm robbing the bank. Yeah, you tell him, Clyde. Well, I was here first. It's mine. Oh, my goodness. Isn't this a coincidence? I mean, look at you. Your fancy clothes and loafers? I bet you drive one of them fancy Mercedes, too, don't you? Ooh, ooh, ooh. He does. I saw him drive in. First of all, these are not loafers. They're wingtips. And secondly, I walked here. What the hell do you need to rob a bank for, anyway? Well, you see, I need the money because... 
Hey, wait, that is absolutely none of your business. I'll have you know that my reasons are just as legitimate as yours, whether they're paying off your gambling debts or supporting your drug habits. You don't even know me. Huh? And here you are assuming that because I'm here robbing this bank, better than you, I might add, that I'm some bottom feeder? You and me, we're the same, pal. <laughs> no, we are not. I, sir, am a doctor. A doctor? Why, that's marvelous. We don't have a resident doctor in our little town. I have to drive an hour to see my doctor. Excuse me. What? If you're really a doctor, can... Can I talk to you about Henry? How exciting. You already have a new client, dear. No, no, no. You cannot talk to me about Henry. I'm not that kind of a doctor, so. Well, the slam has changed me. Maybe my wife was right. She said I should talk to one of these head doctors. If I had a chat with him, it might help me get back on track. Isn't this fun? Now you have two clients, dear. Well, go on, give him your contact details. Contact details? You blithering... I'm waiting. You really should carry business cards with you at all times. Let this be a lesson to you. I am robbing this bank! Not with that gun of yours. <laughs> I am almost too scared to ask. Pray tell, why ever did you say that? I know guns, and at this, that's a problem. That's no more real than Bonnie's hand here. It, it, it most certainly is real. If you continue yelling like that, you'll wake the guard. <gasps> Go on, then. Shoot me. Pull the trigger. Well, have you lost your mind? I, I, I'd wake the guard. Killing you. Robbing the bank with a fake gun? That's ridiculous, dear. Henry had a cigarette lighter pistol. Oh, God. I miss you. My husband has a lighter just like that. Stand the sight of a grown man crying. Why don't you have yourself a talk to the quack here? That's a grand idea. Why don't you have a little talk with him about Henry, would you? For the last time. I am not. But I really need And you! Uh. One more word from you, and I'll shoot you first. Do it! End my miserable existence. Put a bullet right here. Right where my heart would be if Henry didn't rip it out already. There's no need to be rude, pal. He's obviously going through something. Yeah, I know. You're not a very good shrink. I'm not a shrink! That's it! Get out of my way! Oh, God! What's he doing? Oh, no, no, he's really pissed! I got to pee! If you must! <laughs> Open the drawer! Ah, oh, oh, wow! Open the drawer. No. No! I can't. I won't! Henry said, I have no spine. If he finds out that I let a doctor with a phony gun rob the bank, he'd never even speak to me again. Fine! Get out of oh, my way! Oh, throwing me. I'll open it myself. <laughs> Fine, then I'll, I'll, I'll shoot it open. No, with that prop gun, you won't. That's a marvelous idea.
I know what it's for. Oh, there's no need to raise your voice. Try not to shoot my hand. Okay. What a fake gun. All right, shut up! <laughs> well, go on, shoot it. <laughs> <laughs> what did I tell you? I can't believe this. I spent my last hundred dollars on this. Tommy Martin sold me a prop gun. Who did you say? Did you say Tommy Mai? Yes, you know him? Know him? He's married to my good-for-nothing sister, making him my good-for-nothing brother-in-law. In fact, he sold me this nice piece of hardware right here. Ooh. $300. <laughs> you get what you pay for, buddy? Yeah. His is real, not fake like yours. You have a real gun? Why don't you give it a try then, dear? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Go shoot it, go shoot it, go shoot it, go shoot it. Oh, yes! Mm. Oh. <laughs> wow. Mm. Do you mind, pal? Yes, I mind, pal. Clyde, what are you waiting for? Shoot it, shoot it! I am! It's not working! Oh, this is such a turn off. It's jammed! You sold me a goddamn jam gun! Ah-ha! That slimy no good. I'm gonna kill Tommy Martin! Oh, what an awful pity. Here, let me give it a try then, dears. I saw this in a movie once. Crack that lock, Grandma. A <gasps> hundred dollars? Really? One hundred dollars. But nobody asked me. <laughs> this entire Time? You've had $100 in the drawer? How possibly can you run a bank with $100? It's the end of the week. We don't keep money in the drawers past 4 p.m. on Fridays. What if we were to be robbed? <laughs> hmm? Oh, what a terrible letdown. Henry once shot himself in the foot. Lost his little toe. Henry had a cigarette Lighter gun. Henry? How did you know that? There's a reason you chose this bank, isn't there? You're his latest fling. He is having an affair, isn't he? 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 Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Listen here, my little tiny dancer. I do not know Henry, nor do I want to. Henry! Henry! Miss Lance! Miss Lance, is that you? Mrs. Lance? You're Mrs. Lance, the wife of the man who owns this very bank. Oh my God, I'm so embarrassed. I knew I was here for a reason. Now I know why. I'm here to see my husband, Henry. Oh, ma'am, Henry left three hours ago for a meeting. Wait, what? He said what? Well, that's what he says when he... He didn't say anything to me. He is having an affair. Uh. Um, have you been purposely helping us rob your own? And if I understand this correctly, uh, oh, 
You're having an affair with Henry Lance, the owner of the bank, Mrs. Lance's husband? I, oh. Did you say robbed? Who's robbing the bank? No one is robbing the bank. Oh, what a nice, kind doctor you are, protecting my little bank for me. Put away the gun, Harold. There's no need for violence. I'd like to give you a reward for your heroic act. $25,000, will that suffice, dear? Um, yes, I, I don't know what to say. Oh, I think a thank you will do just fine. No, I, but I actually was trying. The nonsense, I insist. Are you kidding me? He just. All right, everybody freeze. This is a robbery. Tommy Martin! What? Uh, hello. I didn't sign up for this. Let's get out of here. C-19Z, close up, pick up Bonnie, take two. Watch the stand, dude. You wanna see that? Do you mind? <laughs> Why are you following me? <laughs> Everybody just stay still. Dry humping me and rubbing my makeup. I don't know, it's not up to me, but. <laughs> that yeah. was the main no. Tommy Martin! Tommy Martin! Tommy Martin! Tommy Martin! Tommy Martin! I'm trying to give a spectrum. Tommy! <laughs> Tommy Martin! I'm gonna kill you! Tommy Martin! Tommy Martin! Robin the Bane! Right? Did Scream it? Like, what if we did one that we didn't scream? Like, Tommy Martin. No, that doesn't work. Sorry. Tom! <laughs> you, you left me here! Sorry, sorry, sorry. I got it. I got it. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> Michael West! <laughs> oh my god. Hurry up and get Tony, you got the moves like Elaine on Seinfeld. Yeah. <laughs>